HAIST stands for Korea Advanced Institute of Science and Technology. And its mission is to bring up global leaders in science and technology for humanity. We emphasize science technology, but we also emphasize the humanity aspect in science and engineering education. We promote technology transfer to benefit the society. KAIS has been enormously successful in terms of contributions by its graduates in industry. For example, at Samsung uh, Electronic Company, 25% of its technical force uh, are KAIS graduates. Interdisciplinary research in science and technology is of utmost importance. So we value interdisciplinary research very much at KAIST. One example is through KAIST Institute on our campus. KAIST Institute is founded about six years ago to foster interdisciplinary research among the faculty members within KAIST and also outside members who are collaborators. By doing so, we can contribute uh, KAIST becoming more visible in the world leading research. And the vision we have is OIQ bar C square, so it's open innovation, interdisciplinary and integrated research, and creation through consilience. The research areas covered by KAIST institutes are very broad. However, I can uh, focus on uh, basically five key areas in the form of institutes within the KAIST institutes. These are the uh, sort of key areas KAIST institutes are focusing, but of course it involves open innovation, so a lot of more new fusion type researches are coming in. KAIST students are very much engaged in these activities of KAIST institutes, not only as their thesis topic research, but also say for the formation of new venture companies out of this fusion research. KAIST uh, encourages startups uh, by both faculty members and uh, students. Uh, one example is iKAIST, the CEO of iKAIST, our own PhD student, uh, who takes uh, KAIST technology and commercialize it uh, for education purpose. KAIST allowed me to start this company by providing the brand and technique and infrastructure. Smart School Project allows teachers to learn class with just a tablet computer. It is uh, the world first, and of course, we succeed through the KAIST. They are creating very exciting education tool which will benefit uh, many students. I mean, they are exporting uh, their technology to overseas, uh, such as Mongolia and the Arab nations. KAIST is an institute with the emphasis on faculty-driven, student-centered research. One example is Huber Lab where students work side by side with the professors in developing intelligent robots. KAIST Humanoid Robot Research Center is established for developing humanoid robot. Uh, we believe that uh, in the field of human robot, uh, KAIST is one of the leading uh, institution in the world. And we are the first institution who develop humanoid robot other than Japan. Humanoid robot itself is kind of big system. Um, the system involves many different kinds of aspects like mechanical engineering and computer science and microprogramming and microprocessors. That kind of task is very, very important work for the engineering student because they learn practice by practice in the college, but usually they do not have any experience how it works together at the same time. Hubo is a perfect example of such kind of big system. Industry in Korea benefits greatly from KAIST. Uh, through its uh, education and training of uh, KAIST graduate students. KAIST is doing research on semiconductor devices. We do research on both uh, the near-term solution for the needs of current uh, semiconductor industries in Korea and also for future electronic devices which can overcome the limitation of current CMOS technology. From the early stage of KAIST, uh, there has been uh, very strong research groups for semiconductor devices. In fact, many Korean chip makers are KAIST graduates, including the current leaders of uh, Samsung Electronics and SK Hynix. Our students uh, have a lot of uh, experimental uh, experience, and they have a lot of uh, hand-on uh, experience for the, the top-level uh, research tools and production tools. So that's why they are very successful when they work uh, 
in the industry later after they graduate. As a graduate student, I have many chances to work with uh, industries, especially those famous electronic industry. So it is a very good opportunity for me to work with them actually before going into the companies. This NanoFab Center has many multi-million dollar equipment to uh, fabricate devices that are really small and very scaled down to the utmost state-of-the-art technology. In KAIST, uh, one of the great opportunities is that you actually be able to take courses and then also do lab work. So the courses you take, you will actually be able to see the stuff right in your lab the day after maybe. So that's a really great opportunity. At KAIST, we have a theme for KAIST. In my thinking, K-A-I-S-T also should stand for knowledge creation, advancement, integrity, sustainability, and trust. So through such core values, our graduates can continually create new knowledge for the benefits of humankind. And I think that's what the KAIST is for.